What are you doing? Documenting. What uh? What are we doing today, Gwen? Going for a bike ride and a swim. And what are you doing right now? Packing. What time is it? What time is it roughly? Seven thirty. Packing Stanley's lunch. Yep. What are you making him? I don't know. We have no food for him. We have that. We have that beef from the other night. You could reheat that up. Make him a little taco. Yeah, he never eats tacos though. Yeah. All right, so we'll keep looking. What are you having for breakfast? Oatmeal. Is that in here? Yes. Can I look at it? Yeah. You're still having oatmeal after all these years. I can't do it. Well, if we had avocado toast, we'd be having that, but we don't have it. <laughs> all right. I'm just going to watch you cut, cut this orange. Yeah, but he likes it peeled, doesn't he? So <laughs> I'm going to have to peel He's it. He's as particular about his food needs as you. Honey. <laughs> <laughs> All right. We'll see you soon. Okay. Gwen, what are you making? A smoothie. What did you make? Oh, my God. I think God. it's too thick, though. <laughs> Dude, you're not, a, you're not a smoothie queen. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. No. Careful, careful, careful. But, careful. Um, yeah, so I'm doing, like, two sessions back-to-back, -back, which I would never do or never recommend if I was, like, a coach for an athlete. But... Because I'm pregnant, I'm just kind of trying to get all my training done while Stanley's at school. And so, I have two sessions kind of back to back. I don't really have time for lunch. I'll have lunch when I get home, but I just need something to fuel me in between. So I made a smoothie. I always put collagen in my smoothie. I've been using needed collagen. Um, it's a pre, pre prenatal, postnatal, pregnancy supplement company. It's women owned. Um, I actually, I had a lot of trouble with prenatals in my first pregnancy. Uh, just making me sick and so I didn't take a lot and I found needed and I've just been loving their supplements this time around. I've never seen them here. Is that the first movie you've seen here? Yes! <laughs> do, they, do they attack? Do they attack? Do you know? Hope, we'll hopefully see that on the way back. <laughs> Morning guys, how you doing? Good morning! <laughs> Morning, Patrick. Gwen's freaking out because we just saw a moose. Do they that attack, was though? huge, too. You said it was a baby. Dude, that was baby. Can... The moose are not going to attack. Why is... Okay, thank you for answering <laughs> the question. Crazy. Thanks for the invite on the ride up. But, uh, so where are we right now? We're at the west of Boulder, heading up to a little bit higher altitude. What's this place called? <laughs> we are going up Chap... Is it Chapman Road or Chapman Drive? Chapman Drive. I... Chapman Drive. Okay. Yeah. Gwen, why are we here? Well, I originally wanted, I've like run up this, like not, this is my turnaround point. Mm -hmm. okay. This is as far as I've ever gone. And it's a quiet road. Yep. No cars, shaded. Like, I don't know, and I just, I'm pregnant, so I just want to do different things. Yep. And I would never ride this if I wasn't pregnant. So yeah, sure. check it out. Yep. And so how are things going on the exercise slash pregnancy front? You're around halfway through the... Uh... Yep, like 23 weeks. Yep. I just feel very like purposeless. Okay. What's the opposite of purpose? <laughs> Whatever no that purpose. word is. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, trying to just like be active yep. and healthy. Mm -hmm. But also I really miss like going super hard. Yep. But it's going fine, wouldn't you say, Pat? It's a little like, you know, I'm a type A, type a athlete. Yep. And like yesterday, I didn't do anything. I went for a walk. Well, that's something. I guess. <laughs> um, but then other days, I'll go crazy. I'll like swim, bike, elliptical, run. Yeah. So just kind of whatever I feel like. Okay. Yeah. And having been through this once before, obviously, with, uh, with Stanley, yep. was there any uh, lessons learned the first time around? Or like, have you changed the point in which you've stopped running or anything like that? Or Yeah, everything has changed. With really? Stanley, I was running like 100 miles a week at this point. Oh, wow. Okay. Um, but I'm just, this time around, I more just want to like, make it fun. Yep. So using this as like, a long break from training. So that I have so much motivation coming back. Yep. Because coming back is super hard. Okay. So I'm trying to like give myself 
a big break in order to have that motivation to come back. Sure. So when you said before that you're um, sometimes doing multiple things a day yep. and sometimes not, are you sort of waking up and deciding at the day what you'll do or are you, or are you going off a plan? No plan. Okay. Um, it's honestly mostly around Stanley's schedule. Sure. So, um, yeah, like, I'm really trying to use this time to like spend a lot of time with Stan when he's home. So he's at school right now. So I'm gonna bike and swim while he's at school. Um, <laughs> so yeah, it's just based on, kind of around my time with Stan. So before we started this route, did you have any idea of the elevation gain or the Zero. any sort of a, no? Okay. Because um, we've been climbing non-stop. I mean, elements. I asked Pat, I was like, he's like, it's a really long climb. Yeah. He's like, does that mean 10 minutes? <laughs> does that mean 40 minutes? We'll see. He said about 20. Okay. So we'll see. That's a dog. Okay, so we're just chatting off camera about the trials coming up this weekend. Yep. We're discussing some, uh, I don't know, we didn't quite get to predictions, but uh, <laughs> yeah, the, you'll be watching? I will be watching. Yep. So the 5K, I mean, I think it's a championship style race, right? So you're kind of asking me, like, who do I think will do well? And yeah. I really think it's the 1,500 meter runners because it's likely going to be hot. It's going to be slow. It's going to be sit and kick. I mean, I can't remember the last time a championship style race wasn't sit and kick. Yep. And so it's like you got to be able to close in 62 400. So, yeah. And so, do you have any idea? Uh, do you have any predictions as to who you think might be up there in the front? Pat, where do we go here? Just go on the right side of that gate. Okay. okay. Um. So we're heading up to the viewpoint now. We're heading up to the viewpoint. Yep. But predictions. I mean, it depends. Like, is Elise Cranny going to run it? Like, she is someone who is a 5K around a 1500 meter runner. I would say same with like Josette and Carissa. Um, but I'm unsure of like who's going to actually run it and who's going to decide to do the 15 or scratch and focus on the 10K. Yeah. Like Carissa. Um, I always cheer for Emily and Feld because she was my teammate for a long time. Yeah. So I don't know. Yeah, let's see. It'll be fun. Okay. Any very close friends competing? Obviously you mentioned Emily or... Yeah, yeah. Um, I mean all of Bowerman I'm still yeah. pretty close with. You know, Vanessa, yeah. Elise. Um, but actually the last time when I watched the 10K, mm -hmm. I like got so nervous and I was getting all these Braxton Hicks and I told Pat, I was like, I don't think I can watch. It's like making me too nervous <laughs> and the baby's going crazy. So I'll have to like have some calming tea or something. Look at this view. Beautiful. What do we think the elevation is? Well it's whatever the Flagstaff viewpoint is. I'm not sure. But I'd like to come up here. Feel like we accomplished something. Yeah, and then float on the way down. And then cruise on the way down. So what, it took about 25, 30 minutes? Yep. 25? Yep, exactly. Morning, morning. Hey. I'm gonna go on inside. Yep. Glenn, you've never been up here. No, it's like a, it feels like a national forest or something. I think it is. Okay. Reminds me a little of Portland. Yeah. Oh yeah. You want a picture here? <laughs> Is that what you're thinking? I don't know. I think we should just get a photo right at the right where that person should give a stand. What do you think? Sure. Patrick, is this a route that uh, many of the pro um, cyclists and triathletes are using training when they're they, out here? So, yeah, so yeah. the rule of thumb is with Flag, and I don't know... Uh, so the the Flagstaff. This Flagstaff Road, okay. not with the way that we came up. Mm -hmm. But the rule of thumb is if you want to be a super pro cyclist, you have to do three hours at 1,000 kJs per hour 
And if you do Flagstaff Road in less than 30 minutes, you're ready. There you go. I'm not capable of that anytime soon. <laughs> you could probably do the equivalent. Not pregnant. Of some, not pregnant, but I mean, at some point, that would have been a perfect climb for you. Yeah. You said it was too dangerous to do today, though. It's a little too, yeah. You We're, we're not putting you on the road with vehicles and stuff. Yeah, sure. Okay. I, I, Matt, have you ever been up to the Bat Cave? I have not. Do you, but you know about it? Uh, Where is it? No, I don't, actually. No, it's, uh, it's right over there. Okay. And then you, you climb up from NCAR. And then you go, you know, you do this crazy stuff. And then there's, like, this crazy rock wall that you have to, like, it's not so bad to get up, but you're, like, definitely, you don't need ropes or anything, but you're climbing it. Yep, yep. And then you're in the front of the bat cave, and you've got this awesome unobstructed view out. But then going down. They're actual bats? Yeah. I mean, not, I mean, I, I, mean, yeah. I never saw them, but I think yeah. that's what it's for. And then, but then when you have to go down that slab, it's terrifying. Right. Yeah, like I'd take you up there one more time, but I'd be really freaked out. <laughs> I would be really freaked out. Curious about it now. You gotta go. We'll go. Yeah, okay. It's an easy hike. Sounds good. Oh, it's a hike. It's a hike. Yeah, it's a hike. I love hikes pregnant. Yeah, you would not like this one. Oh, okay. Not that part of it. All right, picture, go back down. Photo and head back down. Let's do you it. You don't think there? You think over there? Where do you think, Matt? I think down there would be pretty go good. Down with there. Right, with all the... Suck it up and yeah. go down. <laughs> you ride down this or I'm just going to walk down? Yeah, just walk down. Let's just, we're here. Let's just do it right. Yeah. Trails from... Uh, oh, whatever, yeah. Cool. Whatever that section's called. What is that a uh, end car? No. What's that part called? Matt, what's that part called? It starts with an Cher A. Cherokee. Uh, yeah. Something isn't, like that. Isn't that what it's called? I, it's... I think so. It's something uh, CH, I think. All right. Well, we'll we're going to click. Roll down your... Yeah, so you and I are just going to do like a nice a pose here, just a lovey pose. Okay, yeah. all right, format. <laughs> okay, mucho tranquilo on the downhill. I mean, you know I go slow. Sorry, Matt, you're going to be We're all going on slow the on the downhill. So good, no worries. You all lead. Right. Perfect. You get so nervous when you go over there. Did you like that ride? Yeah, I mean, I, I had two thoughts. One, can you even count the downhill? My hands got sore. But then two, I was like, we should do a tag take team where I ride up the mountain, you have a car, you can ride down because that's your part, and I'll drive down. I can do the downhill? Yeah. Um, yeah, well, I thought that was a nice little scenic ride. It's kind of yeah. short. Yeah, I, don't like, I don't like driving to ride, but obviously. We had to drop we Stan like, anyway. We dropped Stanley, and then we hurry safety protocols for you. Yeah. Okay, you're going swimming? Yep. Okay. Just about to ask if you're going to double up today and do, uh, do a second workout. Just swim. Swim. But I mean, I'm doing masters. I don't, I just do it because it's easy. It's at the, um, it's convenient with pickup for stand, but I think today is technique based, which kills me. I just okay. want to go hard, but that's okay. Okay. It'll be fun. Okay. Maybe. I'm curious to know, what's the, uh, will you swim all the way up until you're able I don't to? Know. I mean, I didn't swim with Stan at all. Um, okay. We'll see. Yeah. yeah. Just kind of doing. It's so weird not having you, a plan. You rode a lot at the very end. I did. I rode a lot with Stan. Yeah. You rode the day that you were induced. Yeah. Yeah. Mountain bike. I love I don't my know mountain that bike. Day, but that ride was a road ride. What? Yeah. I did my road ride. I have a photo of it. I'll send it to you. Ooh. Perfect. Crazy. You know, you were like. Yeah. Yeah. Awesome, thanks for letting me tag along. Yeah. Thanks. Right, Pat, what are you doing? Cleaning the hot tub. That was such a joy to get. It was such a bonus to get with the house. <laughs>
oh, you get a hot tub. And I'm like, great. Yeah. So now, you know, I'm, I'm dealing with it. The water. We're going to clean it up. It's going to be awesome as in the stand. Stanley, we're going to play Frisbee, Fresh but water. can you tell everyone where we went first or no? Do you want me to say it? We went to our first Cinnabar movie experience. Yeah, it was awesome. So that's kind of the day. A hamburger and fries with the movie. Pretty cool. All right, say, see you later. Subscribe. We're going to play Frisbee. Can you say that? <laughs> nah. All right. See you.